Good morning, everybody. I'm just going to jump over the fence here. Oh, uh, July. It's July. Welcome back. Uh, I delivered the rest of the barley before I get in there. Let's have a look. Um, so we've got, uh, after filling these up, so I finished that field, as I, I mentioned in the last episode. Um, I filled all four of these full uh, with, with feed for the chickens. And we have 49,000 liters left over. Uh, we also, however, have 83,000 liters of soybean, and it is prime soybean time. So... We're going to do two things. Two things. Um, first thing we're going to do is we're going to fill up with soybean because we're going to sell. But I want to do something else um, before I go sell. So I want to look at... I want to look at our sell points. I mentioned that a few times. Uh, we only have one sell point for grains, and let's uh, just confirm that for soybean. And there's no competition for it, it's farm shop or farm shop. Um, so I want to install a sell, sell point, and it's going to cost us whether or not I should, you know, compensate myself for a sell point or not is, you know, whatever. Um, at this point, we're starting to make good money. Uh, so I need another place. And this is always a good good thing, a co-op. 55,000. Most areas have a co-op. The question is, where can I put this? Um, that would be reasonable. Reasonable location. Uh, that does not belong to us. I really should buy a little bit more land out here. How are we doing next to next to the hotel? Would this would this be good? That is a fifty-five thousand closer to the road we are, the more flat it's gonna be. I don't think it matters that much. That probably does, doesn't it? Um what is this here? We're in this kind of an open area. It might be good for a field. Um what about over here? What about here? 57, that's not flat. Oh, I think I know. I think I know where we're going to put this. Actually, there's a couple of options. Uh, we could have put it right here. Nice 55,000. I think this would actually be a great spot, actually. I think that would be a good spot. Let's do that. There we go. So the reason for that, um, I want to do that right away, is I don't like the fact that there's no competition for, for prices. And by putting down something else, I want to see what it does to, to the pricing, the local pricing. So uh, let's have another look. So it's actually cheaper, and that's okay. That's fine, uh, as long as we have two, you know, like I want competition going here so so let's go sell this this is going to be a lot of money um we've got more than one load and we'll get um yeah we'll get some money this is going to be a money making episode we may crack the million dollar mark but you know what that means right it means i'm probably going to spend a million dollars Probably. I have some ideas. Uh, I don't know how this unload works. Uh, how do I unload? Hang on, let's look at the, the triggers. Um, interactive zone markers. Just right, oh, right at the end there? But I have to back up like right in there kind of thing. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. I just noticed there's some signs. Okay, so I have to back up to the right one. This is the one I want for soybean. Cool. I like that. It's nice. Yeah. 
This truck is kind of, I feel it's a little underpowered. It's very slow to accelerate. Uh, where are we? Okay, turn. Turn. See what I mean? Kind of slow. I am on full, full throttle here. I should make the little marks on the ground. I can see them from up above. There we go. Alright, let's make some money. And it just fits. Um, while that's selling, let's jump over. We'll get a notice in a second. 195,000 for that load. I want to get something else done. This is ready to go to be merged. And I want to get this drilled. So I want to, I got two things that, um, that I want to get drilled. So this needs to get started right away. Uh, is this still set to, yeah, it's all good. We'll get this merged and we'll get a drill going on this. So I've decided I'm going to buy two of those uh, Condor things. Uh, we're going to start with that, see how it goes. And um, if we need more, we'll get more. Um, I don't want the big ones. I, I gave it some thought um, for these types of fields. I think if we, if we had big monster square fields, um, I think that would probably be the best. Um, nah, I'm just going to go with the Condor things. We're good. I mean, they're only 15 as opposed to, I think the biggest drill is 30. Um, <clears throat> but the biggest drill costs, I think it's over 6,000. Over 6,000, uh, 600,000, um, dollars. And... Two of those condors is just over two, uh, you know, 400 for both of them. And that's 30, that's 30 meters. It's the same, it's the same meter. The only real difference would be the uh, capacity, seed and, and fertilizer capacity. Okay, let's get this snake out of here. We'll get it going. <laughs> what I'm going to do is this is a huge field, so I'm going to start... Uh, I'm going to do three, uh, three headlands uh, with a drill by uh, using course play. And then uh, I'm going to stop it. And I'm going to get um, one, of the, one of the drills to run halfway, but roughly halfway up the field uh, and like across the field. And whichever way it turns, um, at the end and starts continuing, then I'll get another drill to do the other side and they'll both basically be both, you know, parting, parting from the middle and working towards the outsides. We'll get two drills working on this. It should go pretty good. Uh, it's just a C capacity piece that, you know, I'm not quite sure how that's going to go. I've started investigating, um, precision farming because I want to run it on, I want to give it a good go on, um, on Zilanka when we get going with it. And, um, I just realized how much of a fertilizer and sieve saver, saver, uh, that mod is, it's incredible. Um, it's like optimal seed rates and, and fertilizer rates. And so there's no waste. It's not just this one pure blanket of fertilizer, for example, across a field. It's where it needs it. Basically where it needs it. So, um, I don't know. I kind of feel like I've been missing the boat with that, not running that add-on. So I'm going to learn it. I know it's a, it's different and there's a lot, there's a lot of new things I need to look at, uh, when I'm, when I'm working with it. I really think I'm going to give it a good go. And uh, who knows, it might be become a permanent thing. Um, yeah, we'll see. Okay, let me, I'm just gonna go over here. 
I think that should be good enough. I don't know. I didn't really check the corners to see if they need work or not. I doubt it. Big drills on small fields usually creates corner problems. But this is a huge field with big, wide corners. I did put the road in around uh, while I was waiting for the stuff to happen. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Should we drive around? Let's have a quick drive around and make sure the corners get done properly. I'm going to assume they are and uh, start folding this on the fly, which is not something you would normally do in real life. Yeah, we'll get a seed runner and a fertilizer runner uh, to top up the drills when we need them build up. Look at that. So sorghum, it's going to be sorghum for this run. Um, main couple of reasons. Um, one, I need uh, a little bit more chicken food uh, stocked up, I guess. But I also, I, ha I have nothing left for the uh, flour mill. I need, I need to make some more flour soon. Uh, we're eventually going to run out of our, our inventories, and uh, sorghum's a quick way to do that. So, so off we go. I talked about um, this episode, we're going to drop some sheds down, so I'm going to do that. I'm going to figure that out. Let's get this put away. We got a bit more soybean to sell. And I'm assuming... Oh, look at that muesli. Oh, I don't know when's a good time to sell that. We'll have to look into it. Uh, am I going to need this cultivator soon? Uh, yes. Yes, actually I am. Um... Yeah, I keep forgetting about our drills. Now we're going to be uh, not direct drills. Well, let's bring this over. I'm going to buy another cultivator as well. Okay. Let's leave this here for now. Turn it off. Uh, let's get this soybean stuff sort out of the way. So we can... Focus on other stuff, you know, certain things I have to do manually. <clears throat> should, we should get that drill going. Let me start this filling and I'll do that. I need, uh, which tractor? This one should do it. I've been thinking about, um, there's a lot of other channels that I, I don't want to say I watch because I just have so much, only so much time, right? It's hard to watch so a lot of people's stuff. Uh, there's a lot of good stuff out there though. And, um, I was thinking, um, there's a few, I want to say YouTubers that I have connected with that I've spoken, well, not you know, exchanging comments and whatnot on each other's channels. And I was thinking of extending a challenge, doing a challenge, um, you know, hashtag challenge kind of thing. And maybe doing, um, I want to do like a map that with a 150 horsepower cap limit. Um, but a big map, a map with some pretty big fields. So that you know you end up having to um run a lot of seed drills a lot of you know small harvesters a lot of you know just a goofy kind of thing to see how it goes 
I was thinking about that. If any of you guys, I, I, you know who you are. Um, if any of you guys are interested in doing that kind of a challenge, um, let me know. Let me know. Uh, you can either, you know, hit me up in the comments, but if you want to talk offline there in my uh, out section, there's an email address um, uh, to reach me for business inquiries. I don't want to... Uh, and I'm not looking to start up any friendships, like <laughs> just uh, pen pals in there, you know what I mean? Um, but if you want to collaborate, let me know. Okay. Um, where are we? Create a job. There's our big field. This is exciting. This is exciting. I'm going to do three. Uh, we'll do them smooth. Let's see how that goes. This is by far our biggest field. Although, you know, to be honest, these are not that much smaller. So I do have plans to go up here at some point, and make a big one up here. And then who knows, possibly here, but there's some ledges and stuff there. I'm not sure if that's going to work. Yeah, we'll see. I don't even know how long this series is going to last. Okay. Um, Gorgon, we said, right? There we go. Off we go. All right, big field. So it's going to do three headlands, and then I'll try to stop it, and we'll run like somebody like right across there somewhere. I don't know. We'll see. This is going to take quite a while. Okay. Next, 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 next. Uh, let's get this back to the soybean. You know what? That was really stupid of me. Um, no, you don't do stupid stuff. I put in this thing to get more competitive pricing, uh, and I was so excited about just using it for the first time, and I forgot it wasn't the best price. The shop is still the best price, so we're scooting over to the shop. see what the deal is with muesli when's the best price to sell that <coughs> not the best price when's the best time to get the best price oh is this field ready to harvest oh no okay it's not you you i was not quite ready for that you'll be ready soon though all right we may try to add another sell point for grains. You know, but at the end of the day, the more... There we go. 84,000, we're at 974. If we not put in that sell point, we would be over a million. But we probably have more stuff to sell. I gotta get this bailed up so that we can start cultivating it, so we can start drilling it. Well, that's going to be a multi-step process. And lots to do, guys. It's getting, it's getting kind of crazy, to be honest. Um, yeah, I'm a little concerned. I'm getting concerned. Um, you can stay there for now. I don't know what to do with you. Let's do a quick run around. The animals is what I'm concerned about the most. Uh, cows, how are they doing? They have no straw. Okay, so that's a problem. And they have no food. Well, that's a, definitely a problem. Um, so let's, cows are next. Um, why are these guys, oh, that's still the cows. These guys are good. They hold, um, these guys are, where are they? They're almost out. That's the old barn. These are the new ones. They hold, I think it's 40, 40,000. Okay. So it's really the cows that are the problem. Oh, and eggs are getting full. Oh boy, we got a lot of eggs. Look at that. Look at that. And the reproduction. These guys are... Okay. Cows. Um, 
How do we do this quickly? All right, let's get EMR. We have lots of it. Actually, I think there's a truck in the, in the, a trailer in the way. Uh, tab, 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 tab. There we go. That's the one I want. Yep. To have a peek at our productions. I've decided I'm going to make my own lime, and I'll show you what I mean by that. Um, the grape productions are not the grape um, orchards, I guess, are not keeping up, um, and I don't really want to keep adding more. So I think I'm going to switch from just water to water, seed, and fertilizer model. Um, yeah. Okay, that takes a while. Okay, draw. And I don't have a lot in here, although I'm about to take a bunch off the fields. But let's get some out of here. Let's draw. There's three bales, so I'll take all three. Let's see if I can carry all three at the same time. Okay. For some reason, I think this didn't work. Oh, yes, it did. We could do four. Um, question is, will I fit through the door? Yeah, it should be. Oh, of course. There we go. Get some TMR in here. I guess we'll keep using this trailer. Okay, too much tabbing, guys. Uh, I have to start running more. I keep blocking my my path. I'm not going to put something there because I want to put a shed there. Uh, I tabbed again, didn't I? I should do this. This is what I used to do in, in uh, 21. I used to teleport. Just pick it on the map and teleport to it. 21. What are you talking about? FS-19. That's what I used to do in FS-19. Obviously, the previous version, the 22, is 20, is 19, right? Okay, what is that going to do for them? I forget what the capacity here is. Uh, they can take a lot more. So, that's okay. We got more. Let's tab around a bit. I want to see how this guy's doing. This is going good. Actually, this is kind of going fast. I was wondering if just one on this field might work. We still haven't bought the second one yet. Uh, this guy. This little guy. Still useful. Keep forgetting about it though. Why is that doing that? I am going to try the um, auto load bales with um, horseplay. I'm just going to drive around like a fool, bail everything, and then we'll see if we can get horseplay to pick up all the bales.
And there's a lot of stuff to do. The episodes sure go quickly. Feels like I just started this episode. I'm already almost half an hour in. Right, let me bail this up guys I won't keep you I won't keep you watching all these bails we'll, I'll get back to you in a minute all right we're almost done here it's taking a little bit of time but it's going it's going pretty quick with this bailer I can't imagine doing this with a real bailer I mean you know yeah I could do it but It'll be take quite a while to do. I'm gonna try not to do too much straw. Well not not do more straw than we need, I guess that's that's the key. Okay, in silage though, we're gonna have to do lots and lots of that. That, that condor is doing a really good job. The corners are even, they're not bad. I mean, they're, they're missing a little bit there, but not, not a ton. So we're going to set up a few different types of sheds. Um, we're going to end up with a, you know, basically a full stable of um, tractors. So we have four right now. Uh, we're probably going to, you know, grow almost maybe to eight. I do have another one that I want to purchase very soon. Very, very soon. But um, we'll need, I think we're going to have like a tractor shed where just the tractors are and then I need one for harvesters um, you know more the the pull through type and then uh, another for implements and maybe a couple for implements we already have one so we'll make we might add another one and we might eventually end up with remote remote sheds um, that are you know kind of off in the distance as we expand our fields further and further out but we don't have to drive so much all right that's it we're done so i am going to attempt to get a uh horseplay helper to pick up all these bales i did it successfully on another map and it's not something i normally use but i want to give it another go here So let me go get the trailer. We'll go bring this back, get the trailer, and then we'll get that going. Then we're going to have a look and see um, about that drilling. We need to buy. It's, it's going to be shopping time a little bit. As the clock has been ticking, we've been making money every hour. And uh, we're almost at a million. But we may not make it because I'm going to spend some. There's our trailer. I use this tractor. All right, automatically defaults to collecting wrapping bales. It'll wrap bales too, that's kind of cool. I don't know how it would work with the, uh... I 
I don't know how that would work with that quickie quick 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 bail bailer. Okay. Let's see what happens. Um start that, that simple usually goes to the left of the bale oh boy hang on yeah I don't know how this is gonna go uh, it's not Wait, the right kind of trailer that I was thinking of. Um, let's stop that. Let me just go pick up a couple here. That's obviously not working properly. Let's bring the menu up. Okay, and abort, okay, and uh, Y to reset, and H, go, oh. see what happens here, okay, that looks like it might work now. Okay, let's see what happens. Where are we? Where are we? I just want to check on our field, how we're doing. Okay, so it's already started the process. Yeah, we're going to need another one, I think. All right, so let's do some shopping um, before we hit a million. So I'll just watch this guy while we're doing that. Um, I want a few things. I want 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 I want a new cultivator and I want this guy it requires 500 horsepower 24 meters versus um that's not the one we're using what are we using we're using this guy that's 14 this one's much wider at 24 it's 200,000 it's a beast so we're gonna buy that all right so much for making a million um so well that's that and then i want another drill so we're gonna we're, bu we're buying we're shopping mode here uh, we're gonna buy another one of these so i'll have two of those one good planter two of those and one crappy planter well small planter i guess well, that's done and then i want some Auger wagons. We looked at some uh, a couple of episodes ago. These ones here that carry that much, which is more than enough for most drills. And so we're going to buy one of these. I want to buy one. Um, let me just jump back here. These will do both seed and fertilizer, but they look the same. So that's not great. So I think what I'm going to do is get one of these for another one of these. Uh, 19. It's more expensive, but um, ooh, this requires 300. What does that require? 110. That's a big difference. Oh, let's just get two of these. Let's just get two of these. So one is going to be seed runner, the other one's going to be a um, uh, fertilizer runner. Okay, so I bought a bunch of stuff. 479,000 spent, and I still have 500,000. I'm going to be buying another, I won't do it this episode, but I will buy another CR1090. Um, to start working these huge fields. As we move forward... Okay, this is going really well. Oh, tractor. I want another tractor. Do I want another tractor? 
Yes, I do. I do. And I know what I want. Oh, what's on sale? Ooh. Um, I want another tractor, and uh, that's the nine. There we go. And we're going big bore on this one. 673. There we go. Almost all our money gone. Look at all this stuff. Um, okay. So I'm going to. What am I doing? I'm going to take this guy. This is going to be our main uh, cultivator plowing. Oh, doing big things tractor. As a matter of fact, we'll probably put it to work on this field here, and I'll put that other. Um, can I keep both cultivators? Probably. Okay. Now we'll get this guy to work. How are we doing with our bales? Where's our bale guy? Uh oh. Oh, he's there. He's full. Okay, so uh, we got quite a bit here. I'm gonna dump a whole bunch into the TMR uh, factory, and I'm gonna dump. Uh, I'll put the rest in the um, in the bale shed. I'm not quite sure. We're gonna need some in a couple of other little places. The uh, the production. I think we need some for the um, the um, mineral feed production. But this is going right into the TMR. We're going to be producing a lot of TMR. Uh, one of the things on the horizon, I'm not quite sure when we're going to get to it, but we will get a much larger cow enclosure. And so I want to get ahead of it. Um, I want to be fully ready. With tons of TMR and straw and everything. I am going to drive around this way. Probably going to have to shove some bales around. Ah, come on, come on. Ah, there's always the one, isn't there? Okay. How much was that? How much was that? Uh, TMR, where are we? Right there. Oh, that's a lot of straw. Yeah, I'm probably going to be doing some stuff off camera, I think. Ultimately, you know, well, I guess. The question is, do we want to progress or do we want to now just settle in and farm? It's a pretty big farm. Um, oh, I don't like this trailer for this. Um, I'm wondering if I should get a different trailer for this. I like the way that it dumps, though.
Let's see what happens. You kind of have to reset the bales. It's going to do... Okay, good. Good, good. All right. It'll do its thing. And I need my other tent. 1050. Where is it? That one's busy there. This one is sitting there. I'm just going to leave this here for now. And go pick up the other seed drill. I'm going to go help. We're going to go help out. We got to top up all of the, all of the stuff though. Open the cover. We know the routine now. Oops. Seems to be working easier this time. That is finicky. Okay, we have nowhere near full. But we're gonna head over head over to our sheds and production there to top everything up and we're gonna go help helper mchelperson yeah maybe that's a question for the episode I, i'm not doing a question every episode i keep forgetting to be honest um but Question for this episode. Do we hunker down with this farm and get to work? Uh, we're just working the farm, or do we continue expanding out? Um, yeah. Let me know what you think. Uh, there is our fertilizer. I gotta check this production to see what's, what it needs. And then we'll come over here and get more seed. How's the other one doing anyway? Uh, fertilizer. Oh, it's it's getting low. It's getting low. We'll have to get our runners working. I think we're almost finished picking up the bales. Not many left. That's genius. I only recently learned that it could do this. You don't really even have to program anything. Okay, I think we're going to... Um, oh yeah, I better make sure I put the same crop in, huh? Made that mistake once or twice before. Let's get this corner thing fixed. I'm just going to back up a bit. I want to make sure I get the whole corner. Right there. Alright. The other one. Uh, where is it? Tab, tab, tab. There we go. It looks like it missed some spots there. Is that what I'm seeing? Maybe bumps I didn't fix properly. What's going on here? Yeah, didn't like this. I need to fix these bumps. Smooth.
I don't know why that's doing that. Come on. Not this one. I'll have to fix this up. Okay. I look better. Yeah, we'll get that sorted out. Uh, are you done yet? Apparently not. So where is it going to get another one? Let's start the cultivating. Oh, there's one over in the corner over there. Might be the last one. Maybe. More TMR, please. We'll have to look at our stores and see how we're progressing with that. Uh, productions, TMR, how much do we have? We still have quite a bit. Uh, silage, we have lots of silage. So I could drop that in there and mineral feed. Do we have some in stock? We have a bit, not a, not a lot. So uh, let's jump over to this while we're here. So I'm going to start making my own lime, but I'm going to buy the stones. So I'm not picking them off the field. Forget it. I don't, I don't like that. Um, solid fertilizer requires manure, this, this, and straw. This is what I need the extra straw for. Seeds I also want to make, and I can make that from barley, water, and fertilizer, which I have. I could do this right away, make my own seed, and then I could get rid of that little shed. Potatoes, I need potatoes. Um, what am I doing about potatoes? I guess I need to keep those productions. Okay. Lots to think about, lots to think about. Free tractor somewhere. Maybe I need more than one tractor. Okay, this guy's done. Let's get this into. Um, yeah, let's get this into the, the shed, the bale shed. Start our cultivator. I feel like I have my hands full right now. I feel like um, I'm a little worried about expanding at this point. I gotta think about that. I think we may be reaching our point of what we can actually handle. Either that or we just let things sit for a bit and we don't do or try to do everything. Which, you know, I tend to do that. Like, I tend to want to I want to make sure that um, I'm all caught up with everything all the time. It's getting hard to do. It's hard for me to leave a, a, a fallow field over overnight. Um, I, I want, you know, everything taken out of the field and redrilled right away. Okay. These in here. There we go. And we'll reset that. And we made a little bit of money. Not much. Okay, so I need more potatoes. So, uh, I gotta think about that. I got a lot of stuff to think about. Oh, and I need fuel. That's done, that's done. Yeah, I think I'm getting hitting my limit here for this episode. We're out of juice here. So, uh, yeah, well, teamwork too should, should be pretty good. So I'm going to 
yeah, I'm going to call it. We're going to call the episode right now. Actually, we're no, we're not. We're not. Never mind. Never mind. I'm just looking at the clock. It says an hour, but I did take a bit of time to um, collect all those bales off off camera. I want to say it'll be edited out, so I'm not in an hour. Let's do a few more things. We'll start this cultivating. How about that for starters? And then we'll refill this, get it going again. And uh, yeah, that's what we'll do. False, false alarm. False alarm. We're not done yet. Uh, let's go do this. Ugh, running. There we go. Of course, I think we'll do one, one headland. Um, that was the skip. Okay, I have to investigate this rose to skip thing. Um, I think I'm missing the bus on a on a feature here that I really would would like. Clockwise overlap seven corners smooth. Okay, let's go with that. See how that goes. You know what? I'm gonna do two. I'm a little worried about some trees. Okay, go. No. Now this thing is a little skids a bit, but that's okay. Oh, my goodness. Wow, seriously? Uh, I'm not too happy about that. I'm going to have to do a lap on the outside. This, uh, yeah, cultivator might be more hassle than it's worth. It's doing that. We'll see how much of it it does. Oh, look, there it is, skidding again. Okay, I'm calling an audible here. Calling an audible. Don't like it. I don't like it. Let's go back to our other cultivator and give some thought about if I want to keep going with this new one. Like I said, you know, I've mentioned this many times. If I get like if I get something I don't like, I don't stick with it for very long. Um, I will replace it ASAP. And that might be what's gonna happen. Let's try this again. This one works well. I like this one. I'm gonna see if there may be some other additional options that don't skid around like that. For this job, let's get this guy going. Let's start here. Why not, right? Uh, open generator to... Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure why that was happening. It might be related to this tract, uh, tractor. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. We might have to try it again on another field with one of the fence. Well, one of the fence with one of the 1050s. Okay, let's get this sorted out here. Oh. Honey's coming pretty quick. Nice. Seed. You know, I could put these seed huts all over the all over the map instead of having those runners. That'd be cheesy. I think it's not uncommon, though, to have the other silos. You know, the very first ones I tried to use, I had some problems with. Um, to have those all over, all over the place. Mm. 
There's refill silos scattered around the farm. Clear the uh, the course play. We'll clear that out. We won't use it for the rest of the this job. What, we're, what we'll do is we'll um, yeah. See, that's doing a much better job. Um, what we'll do is I'm going to go fix those two problems. Yeah, uh, the bumps there that I needed to smooth out. And then we'll come and get it going. using a regular helper. Did that work okay? It's a lot better. There we go, fixed. Problemo fixed. In order for this to reline, oh, there's a problem here. I mean, these aren't big problems, but I might as well fix them, right? Oops. Uh, landscaping smoothing. Usually a little smoothing just takes care of those kinds of problems. That looks a lot better. Let's run over that. Fix it up. Alright. I don't know if there was others, but... We'll fix them as we go. I need to come out here a little bit wide because... The course play and the regular helper won't go the, the exact same angles. I think I'll be able to do it this way. Well, this is actually going really well. Okay. Yeah, this, this next row will be a little wasteful, but it'll be it. Okay, um, I want to jump back over here for a second. Where are we? This guy. So, if I want to make my own seed, I need barley, which I have. I'm going to go get it. Um, I think we're good with chicken feed for a while. So, I'm not too worried about using this barley up. I'll take, the, I'll take it all. I'll take it all. I'll take it all and... Uh, excuse me. If I set this to, so here's what I'm a little worried about. Um, how much solid fertilizer? Um, so it's the same amount, 7942. See, if I set it to auto distribute, actually, I might not need to. I don't think I need to. So if I'm doing seeds, oops, there we go. If I'm doing seeds, I need fertilizer. It's already here. I just need to, um, I just need, I don't need anything. I just need to put the barley in there. All right, I'm trying to complicate things probably, but and then we'll go buy some rocks and we'll try to make some lime as well. And the lime, we're going to be using that for the greenhouses. That's why. Um, 
the olive and grape ones so that we can get an accelerated output. Okay, let's put our barley in here. And seeds, we're going to activate that. And here we go. We started making it already. It's probably going to make it really fast. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with it. And it's taking from, from the solid fertilizer a bit. Okay. Lime, I just need rocks and water. So I'll go get an... I'll do that right now. I'll go get a thing of uh, a load of rocks. I don't know how cost efficient that's going to be. Uh, whether, you know, buying rocks is uh, cheap, cheaper than just buying lime. Um, but we'll find out. I am not turning on rocks, so there's no options really. If I want to make, I want to make my own lime, I gotta do it this way. I think I can buy like anything in here. Oops, I just miss it. That's the lime. That one's. How much is this gonna cost me for a full truck? While we're here. I am going to see if I can fix this. This is a default map thing, so I might screw something up big league by trying to do this, but I'm gonna smooth this a little bit. Every time I come up with a truck, it j jumps a bit. I don't know if that's gonna work though. This is kind of part of the, uh... I don't know, looks better. Okay, we're almost full. What's this gonna go? Oh, that's pricey. That is pricey. Thirty thousand for a load of rocks. Um, let's have a look at the price for lime. Um, where are you, lime? Let's see. You should be somewhere around here. I can buy it super cheap at the at the seed hut. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Well, it's it's you know something worth trying. Let's let's see how this goes. feeling those two seed drills are going to run into each other soon. Right in the middle of the road. This little, this little auger wagon there is just sitting there. Fortunately, nobody else is on this map, so they, I can't get my stuff stolen. Uh, oops, went too far. That's okay. Come around this way. There we go. I guess if I'm picking my own stones off the field, this is worthwhile. But I really don't want to do that. Really, really don't want to do that. Okay, so lime, let's activate it. And we should see growth pretty quick. 
We have it on automatic irrigation. There we go. Lime has started. Fertilizer, I need to get some work done. I need some more manure, uh, all this stuff. We'll, we'll get more of that made. Uh, we do have a fair amount, so it's not a big deal. Yeah, we got work to do. And then these guys here. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Sugar beet. We might pick up our sugar beet game so that we could feed this a bit more and the sugar. Oh. Distributing. It's out of space. Okay, maybe I don't need to accelerate my grapes. Um, let's just deactivate that for now. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Oh, what's going on here? We're out of room for the cereal already. Jeez. Ugh. All right. Uh, we're gonna carry on next episode uh, right where we left off. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna move ahead. And uh, yeah, we'll take it from there. Uh, yeah. Question: Do I keep expanding, trying to expand and keep up, or do I settle in and try to get this more efficient uh, the way it is? Um, maybe both. Maybe I do one first and then the other later. We'll see. Thank you very much for watching. If you're enjoying this and you're not already subscribed, I really would appreciate if you would. Um, comment, like, um, you know, share with your buddies, whatever. Um, I hope you guys have a great day.